successfully purchased this old desktop to upgrade my older desktop. It doesn't come with the hard drive, but it comes with everything else. So the story, point of my story is this ThinkCenter M800, which I purchased used with no hard drive, has a window sticker already on it. Sometimes you can buy, you know, older desktops with no operating system and hard drives. And you could just try installing it yourself. You can create a USB flash drive uh, for installing Windows 10 or 11. It's pretty easy. Just go to the website, Google it, and you can create Windows 11 installation media through Microsoft's website. Uh, I created it here and installed Windows 11. So I installed Windows 11 onto here. I had to do some registry edits. You can Google that too. Because this computer isn't supported for Windows 11, the, uh, the CPU is not 8th generation Intel, it's 6th generation. But I bypassed it, installed it. You can see this is Windows 11. And you can see here's some system specs. Here's Windows 11, let me scroll down. And the nice thing is I installed it, hooked it up to the internet, and if I click on over here for product activation, it automatically activated. Just remember if you're installing Windows 11 Pro, that the sticker should match Pro also. So in my case, this was a Pro sticker also. So long story short, if you're buying a computer on the internet without operating system or hard drive, you might be able to get a good deal and be able to install install the hard drive and operating system and everything work without having to buy a license. Um, so that's my store. You gotta live by it. The computer, this computer would usually cost around 150, 200, but I was able to get for $70. Just had to add in my hard drive, which I had one lying around. So that's why it was much cheaper for me. And actually this came with 32 gigabytes of RAM. So anyways, that's my short story. 